Today is iPhone 16 day. I picked up every single color variation and you guys can see I have the 16 Pro, Pro Max, 16 Plus, regular 16. But for the sake of this video, we're gonna kick things off with the 16 Pro. This year I'm late in the game, but better late than never. So as you guys can see, I have the 16 Pro Max. And then we have the black titanium, we have the natural titanium, we have the white, and we have the desert. Okay, I picked up two black titaniums. This is the one terabyte model. This is gonna be my personal iPhone. You guys already watched my video. But anyway, here's how the iPhone 16 presentation is gonna look like. I do miss when Apple used to have the black Pro boxes, but I think just due to the environmental, it might be best to use white. But I'm gonna kick things off with the white titanium just because that was the least popular vote. And I'm always going to do least to favorite. And the favorite this year is obviously Desert Titanium. So presented with the iPhone, iPhone text, which is going to be color coordinated depending on what color you go with. Apple logo is color coordinated. So in this case, it's silver to accommodate the white titanium. And then we're going to have this pull tab. Yet again, I do miss the days when we had the trink wrap and get the unboxing knife. But Apple is making it easier. So here's the white titanium. And right away, it's a gorgeous color. And inside the box, you have your braided Type-C to Type-C and no more Apple stickers. You got the request for the Apple stickers at your Apple retailer. I like how light it is coming from a 15 Pro Max. So the 16 Pro is gonna be even lighter. And while, let's see, while that turns on, let's compare it to the 15 Pro Max. Now this is the Pro Max. And you guys can see this year, the white or the white titanium actually do look white. So this is the 15 Pro Max. So it has like a little kind of like a, a creamier color <laughs> or like a little beige on certain light conditions. But the 16 has like this pure white, which looks pretty clean. I must say, even looking at the side railings, you can also see it has a more silver finish opposed to like that natural titanium kind of look. So I really, I'm digging the white this year. The white is definitely beautiful this year. Type C um, on the bottom, big difference compared to the 15 Pro Series for sure. All right, next up, we're gonna unbox the natural titanium. And now natural titanium was first introduced last year. I'm pleasantly surprised that Apple is bringing back the natural titanium, but here it is. It's the same natural titanium that you know and love. And let's peel off the sticker. Everything included in the box, just your type C, no Apple stickers. I can't believe it. I like this for cases. So if you have like any color case, it's gonna look stunning with it. And comparing that to the 15 uh, Pro natural titanium, I would say it's about the same. Maybe it might be a little bit more Nah, it's exactly the same. Who am I kidding? It's exactly the same. I was going to say it looks a little different on the 16. The 15 natural titanium is about the same. It might be a little lighter, as you can see on the reflections. It might be a little toned down just a little bit on the side railings. You're not really missing much on the natural titanium comparing to the 15. And then next up, we have the black titanium, which is the color that I'm going with this year. And it's hard to believe that I never had a black iPhone since the iPhone 6 Plus. And yes, this looks absolutely stunning. You know, something about black phones is always clean. Like, I, I love the way how black just looks. It just looks sleek. It just looks elegant. It looks more professional, in my opinion. Um, let me rip this off. And some would even say the darker your color phone is, the hotter the phone would get. That's what they say. I don't know if it's true or not. But this just looks stunning. Looks nice and clean. Unfortunately, I do not have a 15 Pro in black titanium to compare it to. But just even the side railings, it just matches just one nice color. It is going to be vulnerable to fingerprints. So just keep that in mind. But for the most part, this is very clean. Now, the Coupe de Gras, the grand finale, we have the natural titanium, which is this year's uh, color to get uh, or the popular color. I should say so okay you have that gold text basically this is like gold this is like having a gold iphone basically um i was expecting to see like some sort of like a bronze or not even a bronze but like a pink iphone 16 pro and i already seen this at the apple store this looks good too 
essentially this is just bringing back gold and even the sides if you look at the side of the phone it just looks nice and shimmery uh, let me rip this plastic off same thing that's in the box same as that thing let me know in the comments down below what you guys think about desert titanium are you picking this one up and of course as a channel tradition i'm going to put this on a turnable table i'm also going to be doing something new this year but um but yeah this is this is look this is pretty good i like the side railings kind of looks like a penny like a really clean penny like a copper but the back i think the the back is a little too bright for me but this is really good this is like gold basically so i'm flip-flopping between these two colors it's just the black one just looks nice and sleek while the desert titanium just looks elegant so i don't know let me know in the comments now before i showcase the color of each phone a quick word from my sponsor Taurus. so you just recently picked up an iphone 16 you may want to protect it introducing the taurus on stand 360 spin case this is going to offer a 12 feet drop protection no more unnecessary weight and bulk this also has a grip friendly curved back with rounded corners you can replace the buttons to your liking all contributing to a smooth and premium user experience it's ready for all magsafe accessories which has this strong mechanism 40% stronger to be exact compared to others. And you have the 360 stable stand for entertainment and business purposes. So no matter how you rotate it, you're always gonna find the right angle. Stand is gonna work in landscape and portrait, so it's perfect for your YouTube videos, watching TikTok, FaceTime calls. You also have the ring grip for supportive hole. You can also get the Taurus Glasgow X. Now this is gonna feature a 12 feet military protection and scratch resistance. It provides industry leading protection at 97%. So essentially everything is edge to edge protection. It has a clear view, no obstruction. Most importantly, no color deviation. So 100% original image quality. Installation is quick and easy and bubble free. All you're doing is snapping and pulling. I'm gonna do a link in the description to Taurus on stand 360 spin case and as well as the Glasgow X screen protector. Thank you so much, Taurus, for sponsoring a portion of this video. So yeah, there you guys have it. Um, let me know in the comments down below which one is your favorite. If I had to put it on the ranking scale, in my opinion, the Desert Titanium is really growing on me. Not even gonna lie to you guys. Um, I would put it number one, but the black is so sleek. I'm flip-flopping between these two for real, but 
I think this is going to be my main driver this year. The black one. The Desert Titanium is a very close second, though. Very, very close second. Actually, I'm going to go with the white and then the, the natural last place. Just because we saw this last year, and it's exactly the same. And then the white has been improved compared to the 15 Pro. And then the desert and then the black. That's just, that's my scale. But you guys be the judge. Here's how both the white and the desert look side by side. So yeah, so here's how they look side by side. The black one is going to get smudged up very easily just because you're going to see everything. And the Desert Titan, which is right here, looks pretty good. The white just looks so clean, the white this year. And then the Natural Titanium. And here's how they look on top. All gorgeous. Really all gorgeous colors. And then here's how they look on the other side. This is actually scratching up the phones a little bit. But here's how they look. You have that capture button. You have that camera control button. Can't wait to test that out. And of course, you have your power button on the top. And yeah, they all look gorgeous. But I'm going to go black this year. Now, of course, the front of the phones look exactly the same. Please excuse my fingerprints, but it's going to look exactly the same. All right, guys, so stay tuned for more iPhone 16 videos. Right now, I got to unbox the regular iPhone 16. So make sure you guys subscribe with notifications on so you guys don't miss that. And comment down below which one is your favorite color.